I'm Roy Bertolotto. I'm the sales manager here at ZV, and today we're going to talk about HD video over coax. So first of all, what is digital modulation? Well, a little bit of history. Uh, back in the day when everything was analog, uh, 10 years or so ago, the preferred method for moving video content was with modulation. We would take a source, and back in those days it might have been a VCR or whatnot, and we would convert that output into a simple TV channel. And then we would modulate that channel onto a coax cable infrastructure to various analog television sets. The problem with the system back then is we were modulating analog signal, a very complex waveform. It was fraught with peril. We were trying to modulate that signal on the same channel that the over-the-air frequency was coming into your house at. The problem there is there was ghosting, there was static on the line, uh, neon signs and fluorescent lights affected it, all kinds of problems. So the world goes digital 10 years ago. And the first modulators to come out on the scene were extremely expensive. A Blonder Tongue, a Sencor, and others introduced modulators that were upwards of twenty to twenty-five thousand dollars per channel. Now they certainly found favor in corporate broadcast or in sports arenas and things like that, but you weren't going to take them to Harry's bar down the road or to the doctor's office and suggest a digital signage or a video distribution system at twenty thousand dollars a channel. So ZV about six years ago uh, found a way to create a cost-effective modulation system first product we introduced was the ZV280 Pro and that unit uh, retailed at the time for $2,500 and it revolutionized the industry. Three years ago we introduced ZV170 at $1,500 and that really tore the cover off the ball. That put ZV on the map and it did get us into doctor's offices for digital signage and into uh, sports arenas and into sports bars and health clubs and whatnot. And last year we introduced HD Bridge and that brought the price down to under a thousand dollars retail per channel and uh, it's just been a runaway success ever since so that's the history of modulation and basically this little example on the screen that you see is showing you how this all works so we're taking a digital signage player satellite receiver cable box computer whatnot and we're simply taking the output of that unit and in this case we're using component the red green blue output but with some of our products we could use VGA, we'll explain that later. That signal now goes into a ZV box. The ZV box in turn converts that signal into a simple QAM cable HD TV channel. Now once we've created that channel, it's very, very easy to move that channel, propagate that channel around a facility. In this case it's a residence. But this channel that we've created is now available on all of these TVs. That's basic modulation. 